How long would you let your young child play at the park alone? An hour? Four hours? At what point does it become likely that your child won't be there when you return? Statistically speaking, it would be likely, it would likely take 750,000 years for a child left alone in a public space to be snatched by a stranger. Does that affect your decision? The jury is both a feeling and a reality, and they're not the same. Please welcome Brian. <laughs>
tried to get contraband, weapons and explosives, past TSA checkpoints. And they succeeded 97% of the time. The TSA does not improve the reality of security, according to this study. But you could argue that it's valuable how it helps people feel more secure, especially after 9-11. Like, think about how you felt after 9-11. Terrorists had just flown two planes into two of our most recognizable buildings. Did you feel safe getting on a plane that day, later that week? How long would it have taken, how long did it take for you to feel safe, really safe flying again? And did the TSA play a part in that? When you're looking at whether when you're looking at security, it makes no sense to look at it in terms of effectiveness. Is this effective against the threat? Is the wrong question to ask. You need to ask, is it a good trade-off? So using, so let's talk about terrorism some more. And uh, let's say you're concerned, you're specifically concerned about terrorist attacks, let's say mass shootings. And you want to protect yourself against that threat because you're worried about it. So you go out and you buy a bulletproof vest to protect yourself from a mass shooting. Is this effective against the threat? Absolutely. If somebody shoots at you, you're protected now. But is it a good trade-off? You're walking around with a bulletproof vest. It's bulky, it's hot, it's ugly. And the reality is you're extremely unlikely to be involved in a terrorist attack. You're more likely to win the lottery get struck by lightning a couple times. For most of us, additional security is not worth the trade-off.